Hello, I'm Errol and I work as a designer and product manager at Simply Secure. Hi, I'm Kelsey. I'm a UX designer at Simply Secure. We're here to talk about the Useful Tools project. This is a project where we created resources for open source software tool teams so that these teams can better understand the design and involve their users. The first part of this work was to interview and gather insights from open source software tool teams and developers about what they need. We kept these insights in mind when we created these first four resources. Open source tool teams struggle with the terminology around design and really understanding what that means in relation to their own work on open source software. This led to creating resource number one, which was an frequently asked questions on the common questions about user testing and explored some of the tensions felt by tool teams through the medium of an interactive game-like experience. We have a big backlog of issues and emails already. Why should I find more problems? Looking at this backlog, maybe there's something that connects to the user testing that you just finished. Number five connects to our user testing. So it's not about making the backlog bigger, it's for helping the backlog make sense from a broad user perspective. That's right, Hex. Testing can help you prioritize your backlog and find improvements that will make the biggest impact. Usually the talk is about designers needing to learn the open source software terminology like pull requests, continuous integration, things like this. But we don't often talk about the other way around. I actually don't know what these terms mean. UX, UI? I sort of have an idea, but that's not my area. So to give developers the background knowledge about what the terminology actually entails, for example, specifically we looked at user testing, we built a practical step-by-step -step resource so that not only they could learn the meaning, but also they could understand how the process is done. Mm -hmm. Here's an example script for a user testing session. And this includes the introduction, the warm-up, the testing, and the closing, all the parts that make up a good user testing session. We noticed that designers and developers needed to start from a common understanding and user interviews are the perfect way to do that. This resource is about mapping your findings from user interviews and user research in order to create a common starting point for your future work together as designers and developers on open source tools. After the user interviews, and especially after talking about the interviews together, I feel like we all really understood what the issues are. Here on the microsite, you can see the resource synthesis for open source, which explains common mapping synthesis processes and the prep work that is involved. And here is an open source tool team at work on synthesis in a work session. These three resources that you just saw help teams work together and work with users through user testing. But next, we wanted to learn more ways that designers and developers collaborate. So we invited a panel from the community to come on the podcast, Sustaining Open Source Design. There, we heard about designers and developers working together, prioritizing participation in the early stages of the pro project, like the kickoff, onboarding, and the later stages, like user testing and implementation. I do facilitate the conversations between design and developer. And where I get involved is when I can see that a developer is talking more about how the thing works rather than how it's going to be used. And that is a very important thing to be able to narrow in on. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching and check out our resources for open source software tool teams over at Usable Tools, a Dev's Guide 2. The link will be in the description.